dear students welcome to our channel ms physics where physics get charged the last two videos were discuss the dark product and its properties by using this now in this video we will discuss the angle between the diagonals of a cube with a, a side a so in this uh, here i am consider a simple cube o a b c d e f g in a plane of x y and z axis so here we need to find the angle between the diagonals here when are taking the body diagonals of a cube so we will get one diagonal which is from o, o to g is a one and another diagonal from c to f is a cf okay so from figure can i take uh, the diagonal og which is said to be d1 bar so as this og is present in a xy plane so we take all the sides are same a i cap plus a j cap plus a is k cap and because it is a regular cube so that uh, all the sides are same right and now here this y z plane is in the plane of the board and x axis is away from the plane of the board so that here as this uh, under board diagonal is a c f bar so this c f bar we can write as d2 the second diagonal so in the second diagonal we can write x axis is okay it is uh, into the plane of the board so we can write minus a kya plus a j kya plus a k kya so the same thing if you are taking this is the x this y and here is the z so you can write the second diagonal as a i plus a j minus a k right so now the question is angle between angle between d1 bar and uh, d2 bar as d1 bar and d2 bar are said to be the two vectors in the form of a diagonals of this given q so we know uh, to find the angle between the two vectors from dark product d1 bar dot d2 bar is equals to mod d1 into mod d2 into cos theta by using this we can write the angle between them as d1 cos theta is equals to d1 bar dot d2 bar by mod d1 into mod d2 so at first term in this i am finding a the dark product of two diagonals of d1 bar dot d2 bar this is equals to d1 bar here we have a i cap plus a j cap plus a k cap dot d2 bar is minus a i cap plus a j cap plus a k cap so that here we will get a a dot minus a okay is a minus a square i dot i is a one plus a into a a square j dot j is a one plus a square k dot k is a one so that you will get here my d1 bar dot d2 bar is equals to a square is equals to a square now i am finding the magnitudes of d1 and d2 so magnitude of d1 can be find by using this is under root of a square plus a square plus a square so which gives here root 3a is a d1 similarly we can find the d2 as d2 is also the same of a square plus a square plus a square so which gives here root 3 times of a then coming to finding the angle between them so cos theta is equals to d1 bar dot d2 bar we got a square upon magnitude of d1 you got root 3 times of a and magnitude of d2 is also the root 3 times of a so here we will get a square a square get cancel is a 1 by 3 so when cos theta is equals to 1 by 3 then theta is equals to cos inverse of 1 by 3 so this is the way we can find the angle between the diagonals by using dark product right thank you students thank you for watching if you are like it do like share comment and subscribe our channel to get more videos